This is the patient's nail six months ago. It is important that the doctor give the patient realistic expectations of how things will progress. Progression is based on the severity of the nails at the beginning, the medication chosen, and any medical issues the patient may have. When I am treating patients with fungal nail infection, I always make sure they understand that what we are treating is the new nail coming in. I'm not treating or changing the nail that they have when they come into the office. Especially in a case like this with the nails severely deformed, those nails are not gonna go back to normal. These nails must be replaced by clear, uninfected new toenail. I prescribed oral terbinafine for this patient and he took that for three months. And as you can see, six months later, he's made a lot of progress. The nails are clearer, stronger, and any brittle nail is only at the ends at this point. I chose oral terbinafine for this patient due to the severity of all 10 of his toenails and the findings of the lab which named the organisms. Clearly, no topical medication would work on this patient. No medication placed directly on the toenails will penetrate deeply enough to get to the nail bed. The nail bed is where most fungal infection takes place. Even though the big toe does not have a ram's horn nail like it did six months ago, we can see clearing at the base of the nail, but the nail bed still has a way to go. There's a lot of thick skin, a lot of subungal debris, and that still needs to be cleared away. Oral terbinafine is taken for a period of three months for toenails. After that period, there's enough medication in the toenails that it continues to work for several months. So at about the nine month period, I will decide whether or not this patient needs to have a repeat of the oral terbinafine therapy. As on the left foot, the big right toe no longer has a ram's horn nail but it has quite a way to go to be cured from the fungal infection. There is no definite timetable for when fungal toenails will be cured. Each case is different. Although we'd like to get it done within six months, that's not written in stone. 
I'll always make sure that patients understand this before beginning treatment so they won't be disappointed in how long it may take. This is Kevin Jefferson, the DC Foot Doctor. Thank you very much for watching this video. Like it with a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell so you will know when a new video has been uploaded. Share it with your family and friends. If you leave a comment or a question, it may be featured in a future video. But most importantly, take care of your feet.